Hey guys, welcome back to VR Essentials. Today we're here to talk about how you can register for the Meta Connect on the 27th of September. Of course, the most anticipated event of the year when it comes to Meta, as this will be when they'll be announcing, of course, all the various different specifications of the Meta Quest 3, even though go and check out yesterday's video as we spoke about that and whether you should purchase it in 2023 or wait perhaps until 2024. And of course, they're going to be divulging when they will be released and all the various different, you know, clear up all the leaks and all these kind of different things. And of course, they're going to be talking about all the games and all that. So let's just go straight into the camera very quickly. So, all right, so let me get the information. So boom, 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 boom. There we go. So all you have to do is go to the link in the description below and you will see you'll be redirected to the metaconnect.com page with a nice little graphic there as you can tell i really like the little animation i have to say and uh, yeah expanded reality today and tomorrow join us virtually september 27th and 28th there was a post by natey by the way uh if i just go here uh let me just uh check it out there we go and then let me go on my twitter okay let me go just go to twitter here we go boom uh, let me go to go. All right. And then let me go to my profile. By the way, if you want to join me on Twitter, guys, uh, you can find me at LaziusKXR. And then let me go to my profile. Let me just do this very quickly. Let me go to replies. There we go. And uh, yeah, so there was a post by Natey here, as you can see. And uh, his post was saying, unfortunately, I have to announce that I've not been invited to MetaConnect. I would have loved the opportunity to get people excited about the new Quest 3 and all the other things that Meta team have been working so hard on. That said, I will continue to preach VR wherever I can. So hi to, uh, you know, Niti if he's watching today's video, although it's most unlikely. Isn't it online? My understanding was that it's a virtual event is my reply to him. So yeah, so if we just go back to the MetaConnect event here, it does say join us virtually. So I'm not sure whether they will actually have reporters and people there or whether it will just simply be uh, basically a, uh, you know, whether it will basically just be a event where everything is pre-recorded. They just press the record button and that's it. So do make sure to hit the notification bell, guys, after you subscribe, as we will try to live stream this live on the channel as well. And then all together we can have a watch party. I think that'll be pretty awesome, right? Okay, so let's just go back to the details of the actual event. So to attend, all you have to do is click on the attend button here and then put your name and everything, select your country and all this kind of stuff. And then basically they will send you some information via email. It's a two day virtual event focused on AI and virtual mixed and augmented reality guys. So not only VR, here's a taste of what you experience at Connect with more sessions, speakers and details to be announced soon. Keynote presentation will be joined by Mark Zuckerberg, Meta's top innovators and some very special guests as they unveil the new MetaQuest 3 and reveal how Meta is expanding reality today and tomorrow. Also some featured presentations of a State of the Union. Get the latest news on the Meta developer ecosystem along with the first look of the new tools, programs and features across AI, VR, MR, AR, Meta Horizon Worlds and Meta Avatar guys. And that's a picture of Dimeo, of course, which looks freaking awesome in mixed reality. Featured presentation by MetaQuest 3, realizing your creative potential. AR uh, Slicer, excuse me if I butch the name, developer relations engineer at Meta. And also it's uh, quite funny, there's no picture of Boz, which uh, is very, very interesting here. I uh, don't want to throw any rumors or anything like that, but uh, very interesting. Uh, featured presentation, everything you need to know to build on MetaQuest by Ji Su Xin, software, software engineer at Meta, and also Xiang Wei, tech lead at Meta. Uh, ways to watch, join us virtually so you can watch live, of course, on the VR Essentials YouTube channel. Uh, and you can connect the keynotes where we'll air live on Facebook at Meta, the developer state of the union developer sessions, feature launches, and more. We'll air live at Meta for developers. Visit us in Meta Horizon Worlds as well, so you can go and watch it there, even though I personally will not go there. Um, and then that's basically it, guys. So, yeah, so guys, do make sure to hit the notification bell after you hit the the Subscribe button, as I mentioned, so we can all have a really cool join watch party amongst ourselves, amongst the VR Essentials community. I think that'd be really, really awesome. 
And uh, yeah, if you've got any questions, are you guys excited? What are you the most excited about? Of course, they're going to be unveiling a lot of different new games. Now, the biggest issue with the Metal Quest 3, to be honest with you, will be the fact that if the developers from the current games do not spruce up the games, then they're not going to be able to take a, you know, the opportunity to maximize the potential of the new Metal Quest 3, which would be a great shame, as it means that the quality will still be old versus the technology you know, evolution. So we really do hope that most uh, developers will actually, you know, start to, 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 to adapt their games and to update their games so that it fits the new ecosystem of the MetaQuest 3, the new Gen 2 XR2, of course, and the fact that it's got more RAM and more power to be able to drive better graphics. Otherwise, it will not make a freaking difference, guys. Whatever, whatever game has all these jagged edges and all these freaking bad graphics will still look bad in the Metal Quest 3. It will not make a difference. We need the developer's help. So if you are a developer, we need your help to update your game, to make sure you can get rid of all these graphic, these jagged edges and all these kind of different things and maximize the power of the Metal Quest 3 OS. All right, guys, I'll see you guys in another video very soon. Hit the like so we can grow the VR Essentials YouTube community. And of course, the notification bell after you subscribe so that you can be notified, of course, when more videos get uploaded. Until next time, take it easy, guys. Lovely to spend some time with you. See you later. Bye-bye-bye-bye-bye.